back to my channel so today's video is going to be a little facts video about me i'm just throwing it out there so you guys can get to know me on a little bit more personal level thank you guys for tuning in and if you're interested on getting to know me then please keep watching okay guys i'm gonna throw some facts out there so first fact is my real name is jacqueline and it's not jackie recently i've been going by jackie in the last two three years once i started working before i started working um no one ever called me Jackie, so it was new to me, but a lot of people call me Jackie just because it's easier to pronounce than Jacqueline, I guess. I don't know, but yeah, so my first name is Jacqueline, not Jack. Another fact is I'm 21 years old, but I'm only 21 for the next five days. I turn 22 on April 22nd. Another fact is that my zodiac sign is I am a Taurus, so I am that stubborn one. So all those traits about a Taurus, oh, there's a fly. All those traits about a Taurus are correct. I am very stubborn. It's very hard for me to listen to someone if I already have my mind made up. I love, um, what is it called? Is it called astrology? I believe so. I, I'm so into it. Like, I love reading about signs. My boyfriend's a Capricorn and we go really well together. So I just like reading about it. So yeah, I'm a Taurus. A lot of people keep DMing me on Instagram asking if I'm single and I am not single. I have a photo right here of me and my boyfriend. I'm not a single. I've been with him for about a year. It'll be a year on the 28th. But another fact is I have known him since I was 19. He came into my work when I was a waitress at a Mediterranean restaurant. And he was there smoking hookah. And I noticed him staring at me a lot. So, yeah. But it's funny how life works, how we ended up with each other. We're just inseparable. We're soulmates. And I'm super happy that I met him. And I'm super in love with the person that I am now and life has a crazy way of working, of bringing two people together. I'm so glad my past is my past and the present is now, so yes. So yes, that answers your question, I'm not single. My height, um, a lot of people either think I'm short or I'm tall, but I'm just in between, I'm 5'5", five five. I don't think I'm tall, I don't think I'm short. It's a perfect height, um, I think it's a perfect height in my opinion and yeah. Another fact is my ethnicity. My ethnicity is I am Middle Eastern. My mom's Jordanian and my father's Palestinian, but I am fully Middle Eastern. I get mistaken a lot that I'm Russian and um, it's because I'm very light. I Sometimes I do the tan, I self tan, but I'm super white in general, so a lot of people mistake me for being Russian. No one barely ever thinks I'm Middle Eastern. No one ever guesses I'm Mexican. Just anything, I'm always getting Russian European type of vibe. Like, that's just a, something I've always got as a kid. I was born in Oregon. A lot of people think I'm from California. Pretty much, I take it as I am from California because um, I grew up here. I moved from Oregon when I turned about 12 years old, and I'm gonna be 22, so about 10 years I've been here in California. I love California, it's my home. I do live in the Riverside County area, and I love it here, and I wouldn't change it for the world. It's my home, it's where I'm gonna be at. Hopefully till I die, like I love it. Is my fave. Ooh, why did I like? Another fact is my favorite food. My favorite food is kebabs. Anything kebab, chicken, beef kebab with some rice and Mediterranean salad. It, it that's just my go-to. Everywhere I go, I always have to get that. But my favorite restaurant that doesn't carry Middle Eastern food that I want to eat all the time is called Wood Ranch, which I always get the beef ribs with macaroni and mashed potatoes. But right now I'm on keto diet, so I cannot have pretty much any of that. I'm going to make a video of how to be on keto for beginners and to work make sure you work out when you're on keto if you're trying to build muscle around your butt because I have some info for you about keto. Another fact that has to do with like food and stuff is that like I'm obsessed with coffee. Like I have had like two cups of coffee today already before I have like my breakfast or my lunch or anything and it's bad because my first meal is always around like three and I can't control I'm just never hungry in the morning time. I try to like feed myself around like 10 a.m. maybe, but I'm just never hungry in the morning. I don't know why. I'm just always like into drinking iced coffee. The fact is my favorite color. My favorite color is red. It did. It's like weird because I will not personally wear red on my body, but I will like get sweaters that. This is a champion sweater, but like if it has red decals or if it's a red sweater, I'll wear it. But if it's like a dress, a skirt, like. I'm not really drawn to that, but that's the color that always stands out to me. I love red, red shoes, just red anything, but just personally not on my body. I don't really like red, but yeah, that is my favorite. This is a funny fact. Um, I've had five jobs, not because I'm a quitter, just because I'm, like I said, I'm very stubborn and I'm hard-headed. And when people treat me a certain way, I just back off. So if I get treated a bad way at work, I just... I won't stay but my first job I personally left just because I found another better job but then that better job um, the owners were not very polite treated you like you know 
a slave and I didn't really appreciate that. So towards the end, I kind of just like told them off and quit. It was after two years though. I took a lot, so I just didn't want to be there anymore. And then my other jobs, it's either like dealing with people that I don't want to deal with. And yeah, so I just feel like you shouldn't really put up with people if they treat you a certain way. It's not worth it. You know, life is too short to deal with shitty people so because i have three siblings i have an older sister an older brother and a younger brother so my sister's gonna be i'm gonna be 22 she's about 24 gonna be 25 my brother's 23 me and him are a year and 10 days apart and then my little brother's eight years old so there's a big gap difference for me and my little brother we're 14 years apart and and that's a big gap honestly but yeah, I'm kind of the middle child, I'm, you know, J. Cole middle child. Okay, so moving on to like my favorite holiday and that's Halloween. I'm obsessed with Halloween, like obsessed, like the smells, the, the candles, the pumpkin spice, like I, I'm just obsessed with it. I can't like, I go into the stores and I'm like, Halloween, like the pumpkins are so cute and then the witch decorations, like I'm obsessed with Halloween. I do not know why it's been like that since I was a kid. I used to love Christmas like equally, but Christmas just, um, as you get older, I feel like Christmas is not the same anymore. Maybe that's just me, my opinion, but I just, I just personally feel like that and Halloween is my favorite holiday. My favorite animal. Um, in my last video, you see I do have a cat, but I'm obsessed with puppies and dogs and uh, huskies. They're so cute, German Shepherds. I love puppies, dogs. I love cats as well. Cats are just more independent and easier to take care of, so that's why I do have a cat. Because I'm always busy and my boyfriend's always busy, so yes. I, my favorite animal is a cat and a dog. I can't really choose in between. Okay, you guys, that's it for today's video. I just wanted to let you guys know that I really appreciate you guys clicking onto this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you again, and I'll see you guys next time.